Emily, good evening. What a mess indeed. This crash happened on the loop ramps between the Tobin and the Zakem bridges this morning. And even for drivers used to a slow commute, this was a new level of frustration. Traffic camera video shows the tractor trailer loaded with cement, rounding a curve and heading for the Zakem Bridge just after 6 this morning. The driver does hit the brakes, but it's already too late. The truck rolls over on its side. As the driver went to Mass General with minor injuries, a team of tow trucks moved in to try to get the tractor trailer back on its wheels. But traffic quickly backed up behind the crash over the Tobin Bridge and into Chelsea. I live right down here, right, right, right across the street. I can't get there. It's going to be two hours to get there from Chelsea. Alternative routes from the North Shore into Boston weren't any better. Students at Bunker Hill Community College were among those who sat for hours going nowhere. So it took me about an hour to an hour and a half to get to class. Even so, trying to leave on time. And normally it takes how long? 20 minutes, even 15. State police said they wanted to wait until after the morning commute to try to upright the truck because they knew they would have to shut down the roadway entirely. It took two tries, but around 1.30 this afternoon, four tow trucks using cables and slings tipped the truck back on its wheels, hauled it away, and finally released the backup. It was too much for me. It was too much. Like, I was trying to get there to get to where I was going on time, but, I mean, I couldn't fly, so I just have to wait in the car. Uh, if only commuters could fly. Tonight, the uh, owner of Puglia Trucking tells me that his driver likely did make some sort of mistake, but he says the driver is not facing any citations. Live in Charlestown, David Beanick, WCVB News Center 5.